Okay, Snowden Resort. Before the bombs fell, this is a popular vacation retreat. Now it's a home only to wild animals. Or is it? Warbot. Okay, here we are at the Snowden Resort. We've got shit to find and ways to find it. Why would you say that? We're not watching you. Of course. Wow. That's stuff behind where we spawned. That's interesting. Doobie doo. Dorsey killer. Just a bunch of Dorseys. Mm, there's no. Okay. Beautiful. Get him. Get him, Joe. Get him. Hit him with it. Hit him with a good good. Okay, so a pillager is slightly stronger. Okay. Understood. There's only one of them. So I'm gonna go give him the business. Two is the best I can do. That's fine. I guess they're quite evasive little buggers. Oh no, he's behind a table. That's why. Take some heat. Sort of what I'd expect, to be honest. I may never learn what terrified actually does. Does it really matter? Who knows? Oh come on, buddy. Crits though. Best part, I can run over and start doing it all over again. It's very cool. Bye bye. Eighty percent from here, sure. Don't shoot the wolf. The wolf will kill you. Nice. Take me to the flame. What do we just pick up? SOCOM assault rifles, which is even better assault rifle, and I don't have to pay for it. Yes. Five five sixes. It's the same bullet type. It's just better in every way. It takes four AP to shoot, but then yeah, this it's just better. Okay, cool. Great news. Good news, everyone.
take some crates. Ultramorphine. Ammo box. Ammo box again. Flick the switch. Wait. Hang on. Let's unflick it. Ah, it's okay. No problem. Remember, lock pick first, then do nerd stuff after. So this is to open this up, but I don't actually need it. And in fact, I think I lost a bunch of XP for doing it, but oh well. It happens. Right, let's go. Right, over here. Unless there's an animal whispering 10 creature, I'm not getting rid of my wolf. My wolf has done too much for me to abandon it now. But if there's a plus 10, or like an animal whispering 10, I will try and get it. Snowball. Nice. Worth it. Okay, now then. What's up here? First of all, let's lockpick this. And then hack it. And then hack it again. Dorsey Warbot. Oh yeah, we fought that way at the start of the game, although the game helped me with that. At the start. Blood beast. Of course, the ambushes and a bunch of blood beasts. Okay. I love instant killing things. It's always fun. Hunter up there. I didn't see you, buddy. How'd he do? damage at the end of the day. Ow. So these guys don't have spines, or maybe they do, but they don't. They chose not to use them. I hit you a whole lot harder than you hit me. <laughs> Some real damage. Okay. Yeah, now I've got enough AP to actually keep hitting twice. It's very good. We like that. that. Ah, the SR2000 Argent. 30.06 is not even 50 cals. What? Okay. Yeah. Obviously, yes. Sounds like a plan to me, Stan. Even more cheeky uh, sneak attack damage. Yeah, I'll take it. Hit chance for this 2% for everyone. For Zen Zoe. If 
Oh, is this another way into the main building or something? It's another way into opening these gates. Let's have a look at our bullet situation. Yeah, our bullets are pretty good. Okay. Nice. Cool and good and fair and fun. Just to repair seven. I'm going to repair that. Do -ba -do -ba -do. We've got an owl of Minerva. Minerve autem noctu acustos coniungere nobis. Venite ad cor montis. Uh, what does that mean? Alright, this is the big plaza, the main area. So rather than go through the main door. Okay, yeah, this is the plan. Okay. Rather than go through the main door. We can get a clean shot of. The Dorsey Killer. Then they'll have to come towards us, which is fine. fine. And then as they run towards us, including the Warbot, then we can start to do things. The cat and stuff will, will force our hand, obviously. Choo choo, motherfuckers. Send my car in, start doing the business too. Is Dorsey here? No, he's in further. Okay. Everyone, ready up. Due to how this works. The um Enemies will come to us first. Do you want to hit the car one-on-one? -on -one? That's fine. I don't care. And okay, now they're going to move in. But they can't actually move because I'm in the way. So that works for me. Okay, Betty can chill. I have 12, so I can only do 12 if I stay put. Just chill again. Now, we're fine. Start the deluge. Then move back in. Okay. Kill the warbot.
The car will handle this. He's taking a lot of heat, but we're fine. Don't even worry about it. essentially cleared the way. Now we can go in. shoot me. Maybe he can shoot me. Maybe these two can shoot me, but I don't think they can. Like, you take three steps forward, then heal yourself. Right, we're letting the cats out of the bag. Enough to shoot it. Shoot him! Shoot her! Right, okay. Move out here. Move out here. Right, we're moving. We're all moving. At least you took a shot. How dare you! That's what I thought. Fucking cowards. Hello. <laughs> you thought I was here to kill you. You were right. Beautiful. Thinking I might be able to kill this guy. Hello. Bye. Then you. And she can handle this turret. Bye bye. Then, even over here. Hoping I can get some cheeky cover, but I can still get 30% 30, 30 chance and they get two shots, so. And only one bullet is to hit. There you go. Bye bye. Okay, then I can go over here. Oh. Then, move down here. We're all moving. I could put a suture kit on my uh, self as well to stop the bleeding. But the cat will be fine. It's not going to be a problem. Cody has taken a heat batter in, but we can repair it. How can the wolf move that far and then still heal? I mean, still attack twice. That's, that's silly. I don't mind it, but it's silly. Come on then, Betty. Hello. Can't move. So now you die. If it even lives this long, we'll see. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't think it will. Yellow. Bye. The cat won't be bleeding for long, but I can repair it. I should also put repair packs in my third slot while I have it. So I can repair in the field. It's basically healthy again. Okay, cool. Take a stim. Take a stim. Loot some guys, because I'm sure we didn't loot them. Disable the generators, because why not? SOCOM, the Sabot rocket, SOCOM again. Yeah, it's just better weapons for free. Why wouldn't I take them? What the? The special shit. Okay. Nice. Nothing worth having, but that's fine. generators turn things off of. Keep spotting new things apparently but not sure where they are. Weapons crit. Yeah, well, it's an old weapon. Old and useless, I don't care for it. Okay, right. I leveled up, nice. Let's improve strength again. I'm going to be able to put on some good armor. It'll keep me alive. A little bit more. Just a little bit. Ooh, eat a little bit more. One level up again. You already look fucking sweet, so I don't need to do anything else with you, really. Um... Give me some skill points, I suppose. Why not? More armor modding. Yeah, sure. And then... Lucy is nearly there. And she's almost there. Alright. Let's invest in the gate. Looking for Nelius Dorsey. You found him. That old bastard Saul send you. The man is lean, rugged and wolfishly handsome. Scars run down one cheek, crossing the line cars by tough years in the wilderness. He holds up his hands to surrender, a slight smile on his face. It wasn't the patriarch that brought us here. It was me. I'm Lucia Wesson, and I'm here for vengeance. For justice, for what you did to my family. Wesson? <laughs> I thought the Reed boy took you all to the Garden of the Gods. You could never count on the reeds to do anything right. Say, speaking of fathers, did you know that Liberty Buchanan's got a hold of yours? I mean, go right ahead and kill me. One way or the other, I know I'm dying today. But you should know that old Percival brought all this down on you himself. Oh? He worked with the Patriarch to eradicate my family. Just because we wanted old-fashioned American elections. Bet he didn't tell you that, did he? What? But... He would never... Even if that's true, what right did that give you to kill my family? I did nothing to you. My little brother did nothing to you, but you've destroyed us just the same. It was never about you, little Wesson. It was about hurting your father. He destroyed the innocents in my family because he didn't like what I had to say. Turnabout's fair play, I guess. I am truly sorry for your loss. Take consolation in knowing that you're about to have revenge. Even everyone thought the Dorseys were dead. How did you survive all this time? 
to the plains. Had to figure out how to live rough and blend in. Our kids who were born out there may as well be savages. We fought, and we scrapped, and we starved. When the Patriarch exiled Liberty, she came and found us. Offered us a shot at getting revenge on her father. I knew she was using me, but hell, seeing Saul's own daughter betraying him was worth it. Must be eating him alive. No love lost here, clearly. Why would you ally with the Plains gangs? Let me tell you something. Those gangs are living on a knife's edge of starvation. They have to fight, have to kill. If they don't put the fear of God in their neighbors, their neighbors are coming for them. What do you know about the attack on the Major Convoy? Everything. My sons and I planned it. Word came that Buchanan was sending for help, trying to shore up his shaky throne. Didn't know much about you. But I did know I couldn't let aid reach him. Got the whole extended family together. And all our honorary members. Liberty said I was moving too soon and told me to wait. I thought she was being too cautious. Figured I'd get the revolution started on my own. Take out you and the Patriarch all at once. Guess Liberty was right. And I was wrong. You could have just talked to us instead of attacking us. Yeah, we could have. But we didn't. Mistakes were made. People died. Story of the fucking world, right? Speaking of people dying, I reckon you killed my son, Jared. And what about my other son, Erastus? I haven't heard any word from him. Do you know what happened to him? He took some people hostage and disappeared. Haven't heard from him since. Maybe he'll find his way to a better life. He deserves more than the one I gave him. Enough chit chat. Well, this is the part where you kill me, right? The last thing you're going to see is a Wesson pulling a trigger on your worthless hide. Go ahead, Lucia. She takes her time pulling out a gun and checking the chamber. I want you on your knees, Dorsey. I want you staring up at me. I want you thinking about my little brother and my mama. I won't beg. I don't want you begging. I just want you thinking. Now look at me. Lucia puts a bullet between his eyes. Jesus. His corpse steams in the winter air. This is the man who ordered the deaths of all the Avengers in your convoy, including you. But it's still not clear if he's truly to blame. You think it's true? What he said? That my daddy murdered the Dorseys just for wanting elections? It sounded like a lot of justification. Don't put too much stock in it. We should find my father. We can ask him. He'll tell me the truth. She nods and chews on her lip. Come on. Our work here is done. Dorsey family sword. Fucking, uh, fucking sword. Ooh, the Ripper. Better submachine gun. Requires seven automatic weapons. Makes 45s. Does 10 shots. I can get seven automatic weapons, that's not a problem. So I can do, yeah, up to 490 damage. Okay then. Attributes. Am I really going to get you up to 10 strength? Maybe. I mean, what else am I doing with her? Just make her like a pseudo tank. Okay, then. More int, I suppose. Okay. Black Eye Betty, Gray, and Joey are not too far away from leveling up again. Okay, cool. 
The Dorseys are dead. Long live the Dorseys. And her legs. Composite armour. Thank you very much. Gorilla suit. The suit is amazing because gorillas are extinct now. Haha. <laughs> Grenade launcher. Death sifter. Death sister. I don't have seven strength. I have this though. Nineteen, okay. It's just Joey that needs more shit, really. So for me it's gonna be like getting very good equipment and then moving on. Okay. Oh yeah, I should get some suture kits on my bar. Because bleeding happens a lot. Being able to put it out put it out like it's fire. I mean stop people from bleeding would be quite good. Alright, cool. Daddy's little secret and coded transmissions. Let's get over to the coded transmissions. Yes, let's go to Colorado. It said busy and I had a flashback of like, oh god, what if I'm stuck? I'm well within territory I've never seen before. This is all blind to me now. The only thing I've done before on a technicality is the Department of Energy site because I've been there before, but I don't remember anything about it. Times again ...with a harrowing tale of a man turned servant of death by his own pride and ignorance. Optimism may make you many friends, but pessimism can keep you alive. Deep in the south of Arizona, a farmer named Oliver awoke one morning to find his crops had grown to ginormous sizes. Melons the size of a prize heifer. Cucumbers that would put any man to shame. Believing that God had touched his ranch, the farmer invited all his neighbors to partake in a massive feast of his plentiful harvest. The effects of which were just beginning to take hold of him. With all his friends and family gathered round, Oliver opened his mouth to give thanks before... Exploding into thousands of gelatinous bits of flesh, coating his friends and family, cursing them to the same fate. So it was that my thirsty little knives came upon the scene. No flesh to cut. No cries to hear. Only the inside out bodies of failures. Mm. Such bitter, harrowing disappointment. Always good to see you, Rangers. Hoping to get to Colorado Springs any day. Oh, thank you. Right. It ain't much. Let's just see what weapon situation is. We seem fine. Buy some more med hypos, why not? So some more drug too. Yeah. Bye bye. Alright. So up there is where we've got to go. To places we've seen. We're moving at such a rate of speed, it won't matter really. See ya. We're gonna do a little world map tour as we head towards the Department of Energy site. Yeah, I'm going up there. Up towards that. What the? What's this? Mysterious cave. Oh, I like caves. I like mystery. The game is telling me about it too, which is interesting. Cave deep in the heart of a mountain. Okay, I guess we're here now. Numerous strange cults and secret societies have merged in the wake of the apocalypse. The mystery cave. 
Oh, because I've got the uh, owl thing, maybe. I can see where the Pavost is from. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Hello, lads. Minerva America. Illustratio. The Illuminati. Perception plus one. Is the Povost gone now? He might actually be gone now. We took him to the end of the game. <laughs> well, we took him to his final place. Mysterious helmet. Perception plus ten. Your perception was bad. It could be extremely good now. An armor plus two. Okay. I've also got that mysterious case I've not touched or opened, and I'm not likely to either. From this far, I'm not going to open it now. Thanks for everything, Provost. Turned out to be quite a little helpful helper. Let's get damig. Get no damig. Fortunately. I can see why you might want the cone angle to be higher, although usually I'd probably have it be less wide more wide. But then this game it doesn't really make it less accurate so I suppose wider is better. Yes. Thank you Provost. The amount of people who have gotten the Illuminati I don't get to see how many on this screen. Let me have a look on the other one. 11.6% uh, so just shy of a rare achievement. Need to get that up. There we go. Stetson City Cemetery. As the dastardly villain closed in, he was confronted by Tornado Lou, the sultry songbird of the Trigger Whiskey Saloon. Now Lou lies dead at Hogo Fogo's feet, and poor Winifred has nowhere left to run. No one can save you now, Winifred! You're mine! No! Okay. Down we go. The abyss. Department of Energy's right here. Let's heal up before we have while we can. An old grain sign next to a burned down farmhouse smells like mold. Stay there not to recuperate. Tend to some of the injuries of your squad. Thank you. Ooh, a cache of goodies. Six hundred dollar we do's. Just, just there. Okay. Off we go, exploring the rest. We've accidentally found our way to the right place. Just need to explore this part a little bit more as well. This is clearly a dead end. Oh no, it's just a, it's a through way. Oh, cool. Makes my life easy. All right. Very good. Okay. See you guys next time when we explore the Department of Energy site. Bye.